One day, someone asked a painter, what is the most beautiful sight you have ever seen? The painter replied, the most beautiful sight is that which always remains unseen. They tend to be quiet, subtle and don't call for attention, just like a beautiful woman, unaware of her beauty. Sailing through her heart, discovering the warmth, tranquility, aura and the concealed charisma, Chilika appears to be that beautiful woman of the painter. This calm, serene lake in Odisha is not only a beholder's muse, but is also a place where life is nurtured and nature celebrates the glory of existence. The name Chilika is derived from the word Chila, which means Brahmini kite. Chilika Lake is a natural brackish water lagoon of marine origin on the east coast of India, spread over an area of 1,100 square kilometer, covering parts of Puri, Khorda, and Ganjam districts in Odisha. It is the largest coastal lagoon in India and the second largest brackish water lake in the world. The largest winter destination of migratory birds on the Indian subcontinent, Chilika plays host to a fascinating global carnival of winged guests every year. It is also home to a number of endangered species of plants and animals. The lagoon plays a very crucial role in the socio-economic and cultural life of a large section of people living in and around it. The fisheries resources of Chilika sustains more than 2 lakh fisher folk residing in 132 villages on the shore and islands and play a great role in preserving its genetic diversity.
these dolphins are culturally and economically important to the local community. The olive ridley sea turtle is the smallest among all sea turtles. Due to tremendous pressure on their habitat, the species is protected under Schedule 1 of the Wildlife Protection Act 1972 and placed under the endangered category according to the IUCN Red Data Book. These turtles are known to nest sporadically on the coastline of Chilika. Even though mass nesting or Aribada has not been recorded at this place, it has an impressive onshore congregation which essentially means the coastline of Chilika possesses excellent feeding or breeding ground for these turtles. The Chilika Lake is dotted with a number of islands. One such island is Nalabano. Eight kilometers in circumference, the island occupies a unique place in the vast expanse of Chilika Lake as it is a sanctuary and central refuge point for migratory birds. It was declared a bird sanctuary under the Wildlife Protection Act in 1987. In the heart of the park, one can see thousands of birds descending during the migratory season. The island disappears during the monsoon due to inundation, only to emerge again post-monsoon. Large flock of greater flamingos from Iran and the run of Kutch in Gujarat feed in the shallow waters of the lake. Other long-legged waders seen around Nalabona Island are the lesser flamingos, goliath herons, grey herons, purple herons, egrets, spoonbills, painted stalks and black-headed ibis. The rare birds reported in the lake are Asiatic dovichers, Dalmatian pelicans, Palace fish eagles, the very rare migrant spoonbill sandpiper and spotted-billed pelican. The white-bellied sea eagle, pariah kite, brahmini kite, kestrels, marsh harriers and the world's most widespread bird of prey, peregrine falcon are among the raptors seen here. Many short-legged shorebirds are also seen in a narrow band along the shifting shores of the lake and islands. These include plovers, the collared pratin coal, ruff, dunlin, snipes and sandpipers. Larks, wagtails and lapwings are also found on the mudflats. Dills and godbirds feed in the deeper waters. The higher vegetated areas of the lake support moorhens, coots and jacanas. Pond herons and night herons can also be seen along the shores with kingfishers and rollers. Little cormorants are seen on perches around the lake. Compact flocks of brahmini ducks as well as shovelers, pintails, gudwals, teals, pocards, geese and coots are also regularly spotted here. Apart from the Nalabana bird sanctuary, plenty of migratory birds are seen in and around Manglajodi village under the Tangi wildlife range. Mangala Jodi is a small village in the northern part of Chilika Lagoon. The village protects the birds and promotes bird watching. The shallow water region of Chilika, this is a predominantly freshwater zone. The fringe of this village has marshes with aquatic vegetation and reed beds that support a large number of migratory and resident birds. A walk on nature's trail over dewy saline embankments and footpath early in the morning brings in its wake a pleasant surprise. Camouflaged in the reed, the birds can be heard rather than seen unless they are in the mood to take a flight. If you are someone who loves bird watching on foot, Mangla Jodi is a place for you. 
Another enticing location is Rajhans, an island bordered on one side by the Chilika Lagoon and on the other side by the Bay of Bengal, with a forest and mountain in between. Named after the beautiful bird Rajhans, this island on the confluence of Chilika Lake and Bay of Bengal is an 18 km boat ride across the Chilika from Satpada. Its sandy shores is lined with casuarina trees and dotted with crabs all around. It is a place where birds, crabs, dolphins and other wild and water life roam freely and nonchalantly. The beautiful ecotourism cottages in the Barhampura Mahisa Island leave the tourists spellbound. A boat ride from Satpada to this island gives the tourist a rare opportunity to savor the beauty of Chilika in all its myriad hues. Quality dining and accommodation facilities in the island make it a wholesome package for the tourist. Temples like Kali Jai, Gurubai and Baba Kundleshwar give the Chilika Lagoon a distinctive spiritual ambience. For the more worldly minded, there are islands like Honeymoon Island, Breakfast Island and Somolo Island. The confluence of rivers Bhargavi, Daya and Luna with the lagoon is also a major attraction for the tourists. There are several ways to reach Chilika. The nearest airport is in Bhubaneswar, which is 100 km by road from Balugao and 110 km by road from Satpada via Puri. Balugao is the nearest railway station, while from Bhubaneswar and Barhampur are 100 km and 80 km away from Balugao respectively. Taxis to reach Chalika are available on hire at Bhubaneswar, Barhampur, Khurda and Puri. If Odisha is a lover, Chalika is his beloved. Painted with a breathtaking array of colors, reverberating with a symphony of sounds and enchanting in its serenity, it has always been an artist's muse. From Radhanath Ray to Govabandhu Das, Chilika has cast a spell on many poets, painters and nature lovers. But such is the magic of the place that even the layman discovers the artist in him once he comes here.